I welcome to this uh, video. I'm just talking about one of my favourite traders. His name is Curtis Faith. And in terms of Curtis Faith, not only was he a really good trader, uh, he's also a fantastic author and has written two classic investment books, in my view. Uh, one is called Way of the Turtle and the other is called Trading Instincts. So I want to go through what we can learn from those books uh, you know, and, and incorporate in our own trading strategies later on. And also give my favourite uh, 10 quotes from Curtis Faith, which I think perfectly sum up what it takes to achieve trading success. Now, in terms of Faith, um, for those of you who don't know who he was, uh, he was in a, a group which was uh, nicknamed the Turtles. Now, this group was a group of people who'd never traded before. Richard Dennis, a very famous trader at the time, had decided that he wanted to prove that anyone could be taught taught to trade. I, it wasn't an innate gift. And what he did was he taught the group in two weeks a method and then he gave them money to trade the method. Now in terms of uh, what they achieved, the Turtles made several hundred million dollars for tennis in a couple of years. Faith was the top performing turtle. Now in terms of the turtle experiment and the rules of, of the method, uh, that was secret for many years. Obviously there was a confidentiality agreement between Dennis and the turtles, but when that expired, turtle, uh, sorry not turtles, um, Faith and a few of the original turtles released a PDF online uh, which outlined the strategy in detail and why it worked. And I remember waiting for the rules to come out. Yeah, you just want to discover what their secret of success was or what the, the strategy really did to give them an edge. And when I actually saw the rules, I was pretty um, surprised at just how simplistic the strategy was. And it's incredibly simple. Um, in fact, you could learn it in a day easily. It was that simple. And yet, you know, they've made so much money with it. But when you actually look at the strategy, you can understand um, why it works and also uh, why most traders fail in the markets. It's a very uncomfortable strategy to do. You're taking losses to most of the time, 70% of the trades were losers. And also, you know, you have got to take very uncomfortable trades, I buy new market highs after violent price moves, which really is hard to do as well for most traders. Most traders cannot, you know, take lots of losses and stick with their plan. They start to doubt themselves. Also, they never want to buy once a trend is in motion and prefer to buy a pullback, for example be in at the start of the move. But yeah, as Faith goes through in his book, um, you've just got to overcome biases to win at Forex trading. Uh, yeah, obviously if you're losing a lot of trades, you've just got to understand that is the cost of doing business. If it's an uncomfortable trade that no one else is going to take, it's probably going to be a good one. Now, in terms of the biases, he goes through all the biases that come into play in great detail in the book. I think for beginners, uh, yeah, it's just essential to know your strengths, your weaknesses, and the biases that are going to play on you. Also, in terms of Way of the Turtle as a book, it actually goes into how the turtle strategy works in terms of its probability-based um, you know, why statistically it's going to come out ahead. So if you're going to build a strategy for yourself, it's a great place to start. It also goes into a lot of detail in terms of money management. And it really is a good book. It's also obviously going through the whole experiment, uh, the history of it and so forth. I mean, everything you need to know about the turtle experiment is in the way of the turtle. I find it an inspiring book because yeah, it proved the turtle experiment that anyone could achieve trading success. Uh, it's not an innate skill. There's something that Faith points out in the book which I found very interesting, which is despite all the turtles being taught the same rules, and they're being taught by a real trading legend who'd achieved success, many turtles were thrown off the program for not being able to follow the rules. And other turtles basically uh, didn't do as well as faith. So you can still see how psychology was coming into play.
to allow faith to do so well and the others perhaps to do less well and others to be thrown off the programme. And yeah, for me, the book just proves that trading is all about psychology. You only need a simple method, but it's your psychology, your mindset, which is the key. Now, in terms of the turtle trading rules, do they work today? No, I don't think they do. Uh, they're not as effective today at all. You might make marginal returns with them. And I think in terms of faith, he makes a key point in his next book, which is called Trading Instincts, about how markets have changed. They're much more noisy than they used to be. I, in the old days of trading, certainly when I first started, you had you know, banks and floor brokers have the news and so forth first then other large uh, capitalised individuals, then the retail traders. So trends were much smoother. Today, everyone has the price action at the same time. So markets are more choppy. Now, Faith actually makes the point that you, know, you need to become an instinctive trader. He said he started off just believing in pure automation. And in trading instincts, he kind of leans the other way and saying you've got to learn to train your instincts. Now, in terms of instinct, that means being flexible in the face of market action. And he really goes in to great detail on how to train your instincts. It's a wonderful book. I can't do it enough justice here. But he's saying yeah, forex trading is so simple and you need to learn to trust your instincts, have flexible rules and so forth. Um, I think, yeah, in terms of faith, uh, yeah, he was the top performing turtle. He gets over extremely well, you know, why the turtles made money, you know, and just everything about the experiment. Trading instincts kind of brings up his trading view to today, where, you know, automation now, um, you know, automated systems really don't work in today's choppy markets where everyone's got the price at the same time. You need to use your instincts to filter out signals and, and yeah, trading instincts gives you everything you need to know about that as well. So I would strongly recommend you go and read uh, those two trading books. Now what I want to do is just finish up uh, with my favourite 10 quotes from Curtis Faith. And in these quotes basically uh, there is everything you need to know about achieving trading success. Trading is very simple. It, it really is. It's simple to learn. It's harder to do. You really have to change your mindset. Now, of the 10 quotes, if you've not been achieving the success that you wanted in the markets so and you're losing at trading, then the second from last quote you should read and reread. If you're coming into the markets as a beginner, note that quote because it is very, very true. So what I'm going to do, uh, leave you with the 10 quotes. Now, Curtis Faith was a turtle. I'm not going to put him over pictures of turtles. I thought I'd put him over some nice pictures of the sea with a little bit of music. Uh, read, learn these quotes, and they will help you achieve trading success. Thank you for watching this video.